Hi. So one common question we get asked about timeline um, by users is how do I change the client's income for different phases of retirement? So there are a number of reasons why you might want to change um, the withdrawals that the client is getting, um, taking from their portfolio. Um, it may well be because, as we know, expenses are going to change broadly um, in retirement. So you want to account for different phases. It may well be that you want to build in lump sum requirements um, that the client intends to take um, into, into the plan as well. So I'm just going to give you a quick um, walkthrough on timeline how to do that. So we're going to sign in and this is our dashboard and the client in question that I want to do this for is Roger James. So um, we're going to go into the plan to edit the plan and the feature to use for this in timeline is essentially something we call the scaled income feature. So. Um, on the on the screen you can see the required income and I'm gonna click on this edit button and this is that scaled income withdrawal um, functionality so essentially all you need to do is to set the end age for um, a particular withdrawal amount so in this case the setting that you're looking at right now says that you know, the client, Roger, wants 50 grand a year in income from their, from their, from, you know, in, in retirement. But let's say I want to change that. I want to create multiple phases. So let's say I'm going to say, well, in the first couple of years in retirement, they're going to be spending 50 grand. Um, and then let's say that we expect that that will drop down um, because they've traveled and, and you know they've been there done that and so they're going to do less traveling i'm going to change that to forty thousand to to start at age 70. but let's say that um on their 75th birthday there is an important expenditure um a one-off expenditure that we we want to plan for and let's say that that is additional 50 grand over and above um the forty thousand that they they normally will take so in that particular year at age 90 75 i'm going to change the withdrawal to ninety thousand. so just to account for that one off um, expenditure so as you can see now I've created multiple phases of retirement and I've built in a lump sum into that. You can create as many of these as you want. So let's say that you think that in later life, um, let's say at um, age 90, if they survive that age, then there is going to be, um, you know, higher healthcare cost or, or, you know, care home cost or whatever that is. And you think that from that point onwards they're going to need 60 grand a year not 40 then of course you can build that into the into the plan as well so as you can see i have now got a skilled withdrawal feature um, or skilled income feature so that um then no, it's not just a static um you know thirty thousand pounds a year anyway hope that makes sense um if you have any questions drop them in your comment section below